hello children welcome back to my channel in this video we will discuss about bird bath and care of birds and question answers also we will discuss okay now look at the picture here it is an artificial puddle or a shallow container that carries water for the birds can you see the picture it's an artificial puddle or a shallow it's a container in this inside the, the inside this container we have to pour a water for the birds so usually this container will be placed in a garden so birds can drink bath and cool them in this water so birds will come and they will drink the water if they wants to do the bath they will do the bath also so after by doing the bath they will cool their body okay they will cool themselves okay in that water now what is the now what are the case of a birds so how we can take the birds care okay we should not put the birds in the cage okay so we should uh, we should not put them in the cage we have we have to give them their freedoms we should not touch the nest or eggs of the birds okay we should not hurt birds by throwing stones or other any objects we should not throw anything the birds okay we should we should give them a clean water to drink and food also to eat and we should take care of the injured bird if you see anywhere injured birds means you, have, you should take care of that bird okay and we should make a bird bath to provide the for the birds so like this type of a container you have to make and place in a place it in, in the garden so birds can come and drink and bath they can do the bath also okay now next is so let us discuss discuss about question answers okay now everything is marked already so birds have two legs birds keeps their body uh, bodies warm by down feather so um, as you know it is having a three three types of feathers body feathers down feathers and flight feathers so down feathers keeps them warm the shape the shape of the birds body is like a boat why because by being a board of a boat shape of a bird it can i mean they can fly they can move fast in the air actually okay which of the following bird has a birds has a short hard and strong beak pigeon has a short hard and strong beak so they can crush the nuts and they can they, they can crush the seeds and they can eat the um grains okay now which of the following birds have a talons so flesh eating birds having a talons it, it is like a curved shape the curved and shape of the claws will be there uh, because of uh, with the help of tal uh, talons they will hold their food food i mean they will hold their flesh okay next give two example of the following two birds that cannot fly ostrich and kiwi fruit you can write penguin also okay two types of feathers body feathers and down feathers and one more is flight feathers okay two birds that eat seeds pigeon and sparrow okay next answer the following we will discuss at the last okay now draw your favorite bird and label it's a body that which bird you like to you can draw it okay now write the names of the birds in the table perching birds are pigeon and sparrow warding birds herons and crans swimming birds duck and swan flesh eating birds uh, eagles and vultures climbing birds that is woodpeckers and parrots okay give reason we will discuss at the last part okay now uh, okay now join the birds the to the kinds of the nest they make okay now you, you just look at the picture here is a okay I have, I mean, my, one of my students already did this. You just look at the picture, okay? Okay. And here it is the uncramble the names of the birds. The first one is duck, owl, luku, cuckoo, sorry, cuckoo, eagle, sparrow, parrot, okay? Okay, now let us discuss about the question answer that was the c part so here so first question is where do the birds lays egg so in the nest only they lays their egg how does the tail of birds make its nest with the help of beak they sieve the leaves okay what is the birds bath so it is an artificial puddle or a shallow container that carries a water for the birds so birds bath and cool themselves 
what help to bird to fly actually flight feathers helps to bird fly okay now the give reasons hummingbirds has a it's a long okay a hummingbird has a long and pointed beak why because um, by being a long and pointed beak so they can suck the nectar from the flowers birds build nest yes birds also need a shelter like us so that's why they um, build a nest for them eagle has a curved claws yes so why because so they can hold their flesh very easily okay no birds have boat shaped body so they can move fast through the air so that's why they are having a boat shaped body so here is this chapter completed okay thank you